Hey guys, welcome back to program and today in this episode, we're going to talk about UTM virtualization. So guys, if you want to get virtual machines, there's a free software available for the MacBooks with the Apple Silicon. So if you want to create a virtual machine for Windows or for Linux, you can use UTM virtualization software. Now, this is one of the free software that is currently available onto the market. And this is completely and free version. There is no freemium or premium version into it. So it stays free software for a very long time. And now we also have in support for the ARM64 processors that is the Apple Silicon in the new MacBook. But there's a small problem in the UTM software. The problem is that it currently does not support the 3D acceleration for the GPU in the new MacBooks with the Apple Silicon. So if you want to use 3D acceleration for GPU, that is in any of the virtual machine that you'll be creating for Windows or for Linux, so you'll not be able to use the GPU of the Apple Silicon right now using the UTM. So this is one of the reasons why UTM virtualization is not one of the much recommended softwares for the people who want to use virtual machines specifically for the graphics need. So if you want to use OpenGL, DirectX or any of the kind of 3D acceleration that utilizes the GPU enability. So this is where somewhere this software actually lags behind. But in spite of that, if you want to just use a virtual machine in the, any of the new Apple Silicon MacBook, so you can definitely use this software. Try this using once at least because this is available completely for free as compared to the parallels which comes with the subscription cost and also VMware which is right now not available as a stable version for any of the MacBooks. So if you want to use just a virtual machine for some of the software, so you can definitely use this software. And if you get into the gallery section there, you can find a lot of number of already pre-made or you can find some tutorials on how to create different virtual machines in the new macbooks with the apple silicon processor so there is already a complete guide available and there are also some of the virtual machines that are existing here that is for windows 7 and many of the linux distributions so you can find a complete guide or you can directly find and download link over here that you can download and directly use that as a virtual machine so that is one of the best thing that is provided right now by utm so if you want to check that out you can definitely check that out the link is down in the description below and if you've got any more questions any more queries regarding this so please leave that down in the comment section below we'll be happy to read that and reply to you and if you liked our video please hit that like button and subscribe to our channel meet you next episode till then goodbye